in Excel you can convert a decimal number to a fraction so that it is easy to read. For example, 17.5 could be displayed as 17 and half and 12.75 could be displayed as 12 and 3 quarters. To do that, select the number that you would like to convert. Under the home ribbon, go to the number group and from the drop down select fraction. As you can see, 17.5 has been converted to 17 and half. To do the same conversion for multiple cells, choose the cells that you would like to convert and apply the same formula. As you can see all the numbers have been converted. As part of the standard option the fraction that gets generated has only a single digit in the denominator. So while the top three numbers have been converted 13.9 when converted to a fraction would have given 13 9 tenth and 10 has two digits in the denominator so it does not do a conversion but it actually rounds it up to 14 there are other formats also available and if you would like to apply one of those we can select the number and go back to the drop down and select more number formats this now gives you a list of different formats that are available. If I choose up to two digits, that should be able to show me the one with denominator is 10. A sample section here on top also shows you what your output would look like. That way you can decide if it meets your requirements before you select the format. So let's click OK here and see what happens. So as you can see, 14 has now changed to 13 9 over 10. To apply the same format to all the different cells, you could use a format painter. So select the cell that has the base format, click on format painter and then apply that format to the other cells. Now each of them are in the same format. A quick way to set up the format is also to click on the small arrow that's under the number group which also opens the format option from where you can choose the format that you would like to apply you can also do that by right clicking on the number and choose format cells if you would want to change it back to the decimal format select the numbers and from the drop down choose general as you can see the numbers have now been converted to the old form for more tips on excel visit my blog lifeautomated.co.za